Hello and welcome to the Energy Brief with Peter. And as not have guessed, I am Peter. The first principle method says to understand any concept, take things down to their most fundamental concept. This is what we shall do with respect to your understanding of the petroleum industry. In this video, you will learn about the three major divisions of operations in the petroleum industry, upstream, midstream, and downstream. Next, this video will answer your question as to why sometimes the operations overlap. Trust me, this aspect of the industry is important for you because it is the foundation on which you build your understanding of the industry. Most importantly, remember to hit the subscribe button below to get latest insights from the energy sector and stay informed. Petroleum activities are divided into three major segments, upstream, midstream and downstream. These divisions are key to understanding the complexities of the oil and gas industry and understand the types of companies that operate under each. Upstream is the first phase that involves finding and drilling for hydrocarbons in order to extract them from the earth. It involves exploration for potential oil and gas fields, drilling of exploratory wells and operating the wells to recover and bring crude oil or natural gas to the surface. Upstream is also known as the exploration and production stage. Here, engineers and geologists embark on geological and geophysical surveys on potential sites. The production part involves the drilling, plugging, and abandoning of oil wells. Operations to the upstream phase are highly risky, capital intensive, and on the positive side, they are very lucrative as well. Companies that search prospective areas for oil and gas reserves and drill the wells for explorations are called upstream companies. Midstream operations are required for the storage and transport of oil and natural gas before they are refined into finished products. The midstream is the connection between the oil production site, that is the upstream, and the downstream sector, which features retail distributors. It involves the movement and storage of hydrocarbons and it comprises gathering, shipping and transporting, processing and storage of these hydrocarbons. Companies engaged in pipeline trans uh, transportation, shipping of crude oil, natural gas processing are said to be undertaking midstream operations. The downstream sector is the final stage that includes the refining, processing, storage, sale, marketing and transportation of refined oil and other finished products to final consumers. Some of these products include petrol, kerosene, eating oil, jet fuel, fertilizers, plastics, and so more. Other the downstream segments, we have filling stations, gas sale outlets, retail outlets, distribution terminals, and oil tankers. From the explanations given earlier, you may notice some similarities in their operations, especially in the mainstream and the downstream sector. Oftentimes, the deep stream and downstream are treated as a division, rather than two separate divisions. This is because the midstream sector can feature some downstream operations. The first intersection we shall be looking at is in their processing activities. It must be understood that natural gas must be condensed or liquefied by operators in the midstream sector before transporting it to the downstream. Even though downstream is ordinarily responsible for refining and processing, there are certain processing operations midstream has, has to undertake to facilitate the transportation of oil and gas to the downstream. The second overlapping operation concerns transportation. Both midstream and downstream are engaged in transportation activities. However, they differ in the sense that downstream's transportation and storage concerns finished petroleum products, but midstream deals with the transportation of raw crude to the refineries through pipelines or tanks. Now I'm sure you have a better perspective to how the operations in the petroleum industry work. Just to note as a recap, upstream operations concern identifying extraction and production of crude oil and gas. Midstream deals with transportation, storage and processing of the extracted oil and gas. Downstream refers to finding, marketing, sales, distribution of finished petroleum products such as kerosene, diesel, petrol to the final consumers. Finally, this is a growing YouTube channel. Kindly assist to increase the reach of this channel by hitting the subscribe and like button. Like they say, applause may be good for the moment, but love is everlasting. Your addition to my view count is good for the moment, but your subscription is everlasting. Thank you for watching.